to its rupee. This is the solved question paper of Zurha district of computer science. At first here are 5, uh, 10 one word answers. I am not reading all the answers. Please uh, pause the screen and go through the answers. Here true and false and one word answer is mix up. After that fill in the gaps or fill in the blanks for 10 marks. Here also you can pause the screen and go through the answers. Then one mark question. First question how P tag is different from BR tag. Normally this type of question comes for 2 marks but here given only 1. The P tag is usually meant to add content. Content means a separate block of code. But BR it just break the line and go to uh, create a new line on the page. Then number B. Here we have an in array that ARR3 equal 23, 31 and 54 asking the address of the first element. The address of the first element is known as base address. The index of 45. It will be 2 because array index start with 0. So 23 is 0, 31 is 1 and 45 is 2. Describe the following int arr5. It means it declare an array with capacity 5. arr5 equal to 10. That means the sixth index element of the array is After that, what is parameter in a function? You can go through it. Then, the another way to write this code. Now, remember in CSS, when we have the same properties of two element, then we can just write the element name together by providing sep uh, comma and write the element uh, properties just once. So, this will be the correct answer. I need to take to insert multimedia files. It will be audio and video take. And here are some more questions. You can go through it. Question number four. I think here 11 questions are there and each question contain two marks. Number E question here asking to write inline CSS. So we will write the CSS code inside body tag and for that write uh, for that we are writing body style equal and adding the properties like background color and for text color the property is color. And as value is not provided here I give us some random color name. Then Write the code for displaying the following. We are a student. Here nothing style is applied. So just I am writing that sentence within P element. Then H plus O2 equal H2O. So we can use subscript command here. Evaluate the following. I think they are providing the answers from the old book. Most of the questions is from the old book. Like this evaluate the following. This is from the old book. Not from the new book. So I don't think that this type of question might come. Number Z, the uh, display the following figure is nested loop. So this is the program. You can pause and you can see it. Then this triangle. Now to make this triangle, we'll divide the complete triangle in two parts, upper parts and lower parts. First we'll make the upper parts and after that we will make the lower parts. So this will be the program. Then here we'll have to make frames, means we'll have two pages, school.html and college.html and that two pages we'll have to add inside frames. So this will be the answer for this question and here in style border 1px I have written there you will write 4px because in question it is given as 4 pixels dotted. Uh, 
identify that type of command update it is data manipulation language alter it is data definition language select command it is data query language and tcn transition control language and this questions are uh, definitions we have to write after that write a program to store a sum and find the location of a so we'll define a character array and we'll store a sum inside the array and we'll count the length of the array after that by using array we'll find the index of capital a so the index will be zero after that y size is uh, demerits of array it means y size is limitation of array and how, how can we solve it by using pointer you can write this answer then we have to write a function that will accept two numbers and will return the largest so here i am defining a function i am here doing declaration and definition together the function name is find largest and here passing two values int a int b and here i am comparing if a is greater than b i am returning a or again i am giving another question is b, b is greater than a then i am returning b so this way we can write this program after that uh, mysql question this questions uh, if required i'll explain in another video now just you will get the answer but otherwise the video will be longer so here we have to create a table and we have to add these records inside the table after creating the table we have to write queries for the following like display the price and name whose name start with b we will write this way after that also we will have to write output of some commands like select distinct company from item when we use distinct then duplicate values are replaced or removed so here we get only two company bikanir and britannia then next one select name price plus 10 from item here with the price we will plus 10 Pujia price was 120 so here it will be 130 like Pujia 130 biscuit uh, 60 and cake 80 select name price from item where where it is not not id 002 so it means only 002's details will not get 001 and 003's details we will get and we have to write the command to create the following list so this is the code to create the list after that we have to write html command for the following you can write this way you can write all the answers together as i have written in c or you can write separately it's your wish now pointer question this question also if required i'll explain in another video now you can just get the answers from here then describe the following inheritance polymorphism abstraction and encapsulation so these are the answers of Chorha district questions are not that hard but uh, a bit confusing and also the marks are very less according to the questions and most of the questions are from the old book i think they are just following old question question bank and giving the question from there only thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye